think the bit to understand about that, and probably something that maybe, and maybe rightfully so, fans perhaps don't understand, is that we have a board. Uh, I mean, for, for a long time, he, both good and bad, the chairman was the owner, and so the chairman called the shots because he was the owner, and that was it. I think that if you look at the structure of our board, there are seven people on it with seven votes and seven opinions. Um, and, and so I think my position is quite simple. I think I have most of the responsibility and n nowhere near enough of the authority. I've said many times before, that one of the most painful experiences I've had in my life, let alone in football, was to, was to relieve Guy of his duties. So if you say damned if you do, damned if you don't, I mean, I guess it might be worth referring to my comment in the programme where I said something that apparently you shouldn't say in football, but then I'm not anything other than a fan, a must-win game. And I think you might be referring to that, so let's, let's refer to that. As far as I'm concerned, when you're something like two points away from the relegation zone, um, relegation spots more than halfway through the season, and a couple of the sides are at the bottom start to pick up points, if that's not a must-win game, I don't know what is. You know, with the exception of obviously the, the Premier League, which is, which is as, as much like football as Hollywood is like the King's Theatre, that, that the reality of life is that the business of football, except for certain very um, privileged uh, clubs, is actually, in my opinion, not run very well.